always said in Black Panther Party that they can do anything they want to to us. We might not be back. I might be in jail. I might be anywhere. But when I leave, you can remember I said with the last words on my lips that I am a revolutionary. And you're going to have to keep on saying that. You're going to have to say that I am a proletarian. I am the people. I'm not the pig. You've got to make a distinction. And the people are going to have to attack the pigs. The people are going to have to stand up against the pigs. That's what the Panthers are doing. That's what the Panthers are doing all over the world. Well, this expression cannot just be defined in one word because uh, it represents a lot of things. It represents, for example, our belief that in Africa, the kind of economic, social and political institutions that make sense must find their meaning in the African setup. Uh, that any new organization which we bring up must be based on some traditional concepts to life. Uh, it must not just be imported from outside. For example, we are uh, uh, clan-minded, we are tribal-minded, in that we are communal in our concept of life. Now, it is necessary that our new institutions are based on this approach, what we have called in our definition of African socialism, mutual social responsibility. That is, that a person is not just an individual, he's part of a system, he's part of a community. He has responsibilities within that community. He has duties to perform in that community. But in turn, the community has also got responsibility to him. They have duties towards him and his children. I am a revolutionary, and you're going to have to keep on saying that. You're going to have to say that I am a proletarian. I am the people. I'm not the pig. You've got to make a distinction. And the people are going to have to attack the pig. The people are going to have to stand up against the pig. That's what the pastors are doing. That's what the pastors are doing all over the world. There was this element that there was belief in a supreme human, a supreme being. That is, we paid homage to God or gods. We acknowledged there existed a God. We had certain religious functions, not denominational, but born in our tradition. Before we harvest, we have to do certain things to pay homage to God. Before we go to um, break the ground for cultivation, we pay homage to God. So that there is a distinction, for example, between what we believe in as socialists of Europe uh, and the Labour Party in Britain is that we believe that our socialism must be founded from certain African traditions. I am a revolutionary, and you're going to have to keep on saying that. You're going to have to say that I am a proletarian. I am the people. I'm not the pig. You've got to make a distinction, and the people are going to have to attack the pig. The people are going to have to stand up against the pig. That's what the Panthers are doing. That's what the Panthers are doing all over the world. that change there will be. But this change cannot be in terms of pious resolutions and words. It's got to be translated into action. For it is only then that we shall know that there is a definite departure from the past, from the past and that America intends take on a new role to stand for the things which she preaches.